welcome back to a new video by the Dash Course platform. My name is Johan and in this video we are going to talk about how we can build a portfolio on GitHub and on LinkedIn and how we can actually show our potential future clients about our um, progress and about the experiences we have. So, as you can see, we are on the GitHub uh, of DevScorch. DevScorch is also me, so it doesn't really matter. And as you can see, I have 25 different repositories. Okay, so as you can see, I, I also have some private ones. So, for example, HB Cloud. This is like um, code from, uh, from a client I'm working with. And for here, for example, we have TeacherNode API and TeacherNode. Uh, both of these are a new company idea that I'm working on. Um, in the future, you're actually going to see some more stuff about that. And as you can see here, another private one is an Infinity ad blocker. This is a new ad blocker that I was building, but I didn't update it since 20 September. And this one is just, doesn't matter. So, as you can see, I actually also have some public, um, I also have some public uh, repositories. So as you can see, this is, um, this is a Vapor API. So it's an API written in Swift. And every time when I have some uh, potential clients, like someone who wants me to work on a Vapor app or on an API, I actually show them this one because this actually perfectly shows uh, what, can, what I can do on with Vapor. I also have some iOS applications. So for example, Check My Liquid. This is something that I built in, um, in the Swift 5 course, uh, which I put on my website. Here, for example, I have also written a command line tool in Swift to, <coughs> to convert move or .mov to HLS. This is actually a Swift um, script that actually uh, starts an FFmpeg uh, command. Here, this is like an app called Overtime. It's a timekeeper application that I, uh, that I have written, a messenger app, and so on and so on. When you want to create like a portfolio on your GitHub, for me personally, the most people who actually uh, send me a message because they saw code of me are actually the people who see that I have written a messenger application who have seen that I also create like a social network place is a social network system and they also see like that when I know how to work with uh, sessions with Alamo Fire so on for example, Dreamlister, this app also has like something with uh, core data. And that is something that a lot of um, potential clients actually find really interesting. When they're looking for that, then they see that on my GitHub as well. And this is something that I think is really important. As an iOS developer, when you want to create your own portfolio on GitHub, for me, I think the best thing you can do is a messenger application, a social network, something where you work with API. So for example, a Pokédex. And if you are, as me, also a Vapor developer, make sure you have some APIs or some websites written in Swift as well. So, but how can you actually put this in a way that they can find it or can see it? Well, I figured out on my LinkedIn. Um, if, you, if you guys want to follow me, give me a follow. I'm always happy to connect with new people. In here, we have featured. And I, I think I found out that when you have like the featured option uh, enabled, you can actually do that uh, over here at profile section. You can actually add your GitHub uh, URLs. So for example, here, this is the Gamer Social Network, which I've been building, a Firebase messenger application for iOS, a command line tool, check my liquid app with user defaults, and so on and so on. This is really important. When you can put stuff like this on LinkedIn and potential recruiters are going to look at featured and they're actually going to check each of these um, links. They know they normally they don't do that, but what if they do? It's going to be really interesting because that way you can actually sell yourself as an iOS developer. Uh, something out of my experience, what I've noticed, they actually don't go into GitHub or check every line of code what you're doing because most of the recruiters who are actually trying to recruit you they don't even know how to write hello world in HTML. They just get a spec list from the, the development team or the, or, the, or the lead developer, and they're gonna search for that. And when they see, like with future featured, and they're gonna check your GitHub and they see, hey, this guy knows how to work with core data, he knows how to build an API, he knows how to work with SQL or PHP, doesn't matter. They know, okay, we let's send them a message. 
And this is how you can sell yourself actually with a really good GitHub portfolio. So, and that, that is something that I wanted to share with you guys because I think it's really important. This is how I get all my jobs. Uh, don't worry about like followers and following. I don't care about that stuff. But it's something that is for me personally really important and I wanted to share with you. Mm, these days I get like uh, 20, 30 offers a week as a freelancer. Uh, most of them uh, I actually uh, give to other people because I'm not interested in them or they are too far away or I'm too busy. But this is just something that I wanted to share with you guys. So, one more time. Create a beautiful GitHub uh, page with a lot of information, with a lot of apps or like a lot of code that you read, that you have, that you have, uh, uh, whoa, sorry, that you have been written yourself or something that you wrote yourself. And share it on LinkedIn because a lot of people actually check on LinkedIn when they uh, are searching for developers. So this is going to be a short video. This is just something I wanted to share really quick. Uh, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please give me a follow. If you didn't like it, please give me a thumbs down so that I know what I have to work on. And thank you for watching and I see you next time.